in our previous tutorial i have showed about php file open and read okay now in this tutorial i'll discuss about how to create and write file in php okay so let's go first open your jump control panel go to your folder directory jump ht docs first folder index edit with notepad plus plus open your browser write localhost slash your folder name okay you can see in our previous part i have showed about php file open and read okay and now in this tutorial i am showing you how to create and write it okay so just remove it or you can comment out it just comment out comment out okay and in this block and uh, from here in your folder directory you can see our first folder my first php project here that we have created in our previous part student.txt okay just delete it and here first write again suppose declare a variable suppose i write create file suppose you can write anything as you wish and then by hearing this message i hope you will surprised maybe that f of n is used for file read and open also f of n used for create okay so first here write f open f open function okay i hope you know already about it that f open function have two parameter first parameter is which file you want to read open or create just write the name here okay file name suppose here just write name of your file suppose i write create new okay create new dot txt okay we want to create notepad format i mean txt file and then write which mode i hope you already know about it what is mode in here you can see i hope if you check my previous tutorial you already know about it okay this is the moot rr plus ww plus a a plus etc okay okay you can use anything also you will get this link in my video description box okay just check this link and you will get a lot description about it about moot etc okay so anyway just here write a mood name moot suppose i write w okay w means it will here you can see w write only opens and clear the contents of file or create a new file if it doesn't exist okay here you can see we have write a file name create new dot txt in our root directory we can see create new dot txt here no file existing like this name okay you can see create dot create new dot txt no file in our root directory like this okay so it will create a new file and here just write or die okay when this code will not run perfectly it will just generate error message suppose here we can write there is a problem there is problem you can write anything okay as you wish and here this is the best practice that just close the file or program okay in programming this is the best practice f close i mean file close okay so anyway how to create it okay you can see we have write a f of n create new dot txt and we have write a mood w okay and now just execute okay and go to directory you can see here you can see i hope you can see create new dot txt our file is create new dot txt okay that we have write as a name okay you can see in our you can see and if you open you can see this file is blank okay this file is blank and how to write it you can see we have successfully created a file and how to write it for writing something first write suppose declare a variable suppose i write first text okay suppose i write it you can write anything as you wish suppose i write i love php i write it as an example okay you can write anything and how to write this text into your file you can see this file is blank okay and for writing here first here write f write function okay just learn it you need to learn this all php building function okay f write for writing file this function f write it's have two parameter first parameter is where you want to write okay suppose we want to write here create new dot txt this file okay and this file we have assigned this 
variable so first this variable then what you want to do or what you want to write okay so here you can see i love php this text we want to write in our file here you can see so this text we have assigned this variable first txt here will be this parameter you can see f write function first parameter is where you want to write and second parameter is what you want to write okay you can see and just execute this and open your file you can see i love php okay i hope you understand that how to write and how to create a file also if you check this write only offense and clear the contents of files okay you can see if you write more suppose just copy suppose if you write again a sentence suppose i write here second text suppose i write i love suppose java i write it as an example you can write anything suppose i write java and for taking a new line here just write a slash and n okay it will take a new line slash n new line and here will be our this variable i love java okay now execute this and to go to open your folder you can see i love php i love java here is attached here just use a space you can see i love java and execute and open you can see i love php i love java okay according this way you can write in php file okay also in parameter you can see w write only opens and clear the contents of file okay w mode it will opens and clear the contents of file you can see if i just to remove it i am showing you just example if i write again here suppose just remove the line and execute it you can see we have write i love php in our text you can see i love php only okay it will overwrite it again if you write here suppose i love java okay it will overwrite this file just refresh and go to your folder directory you can see i love java also according this parameter you can see w mode is write only opens and clear the contents of file or create a new file if it doesn't exist okay you can see this file create new dot txt okay create new dot txt that we have created from here okay you can see create new f of n function but if you create a manually file suppose here suppose here first delete this okay and here create a manually suppose i write manual file okay or already exist file suppose i write a name already exist file as you can easily understand okay just copy the file name you can see i have created a file that manually okay you can see and if you write here suppose just write this name here already exist file dot txt w write okay and just cut it you can see this file is already exist you can see already exist file dot txt this file already exist dot txt this file is blank that i have created here manually in our folder directory you can see jamp ht docs my first php project okay here you can see this file i have created manually okay and here again i have write already file exist dot txt file i have command here that create a file you can see w if file doesn't exist create a new file it will create a new file if it doesn't exist but here in our root directory you can see it's already exist so it will override this file okay here you can see it will override this file okay just refresh you can see the same file it have not created another file okay it just override the file and this file is blank also here just paste that we have cut here you can see if you execute this you can see it right it right okay i love java here you can see i love java okay also 
if I again create a file manually, suppose here just delete and here again create a file, suppose I write new, new.txt suppose and here if I write suppose I love PHP programming, suppose I write it, you can see this text I love PHP programming, I write it manually, okay and I have created this file new.txt manually, okay and if I again comment it just copy the file name and here just write your file name okay new.txt w write for okay you can see this file is already exist you can see i have created this file manually and manually write i love php programming and here again i write new.txt file for creating but you can see this file is already exist okay and here if i write suppose i love java programming okay i love java programming and manually here i write in our root directory you can see jpst docs i love php programming okay and new.txt file is already exist and here i have just write new.txt okay and when you execute this file it will override this file okay you can see override so just execute and check your root directory new.txt you can see i love java programming here we have write i love java programming this file is created overwrite okay you can see w opens and clears the content of file or create a new file if it doesn't exist or it already exists it will overwrite okay here you can see also have more mood okay just read it according this way you can easily understand all it's not possible to sing all mood one by one okay and also go to this link and you will understand more you will get this link in my video description check my video description box okay and i hope you understand also you can remove it also you can create a file here suppose again new file okay in our root directory you can see no new file its name is new.txt so just execute and here you can see new news file you can see file name spelling is mistakes anyway you can see i hope you understand news file dot txt you can see news file dot txt and here we have write i love java programming just open you can see i love java programming so, okay so i hope you understand that how to create a file and write a file in php okay and also I hope you understand that how to overwrite your existing file. So thank you. In my next tutorial, I will discuss about PSP file uploading.